Hello friends, today we are going to read from our Jesus Storybook Bible. We are going to start at the very beginning. And we are going to share the story called The Story and the Song. If you like to follow along, it is on page 12 in your Jesus Storybook Bible. Let's begin. The heavens are singing about how great God is, and the skies are shouting it out. See what God has made? Day after day, night after night, they are speaking to us. Psalms 19, 1 to 2. God wrote, I love you. He wrote it in the sky and on the earth and on the sea. He wrote his message everywhere. Because God created everything in his world to reflect him like a mirror. To show us what he is like. To help us to know him. To make our hearts sing. The way a kitten chases her tail. The way red puppies grow wild. The way a dolphin swims. And God put it into words, too, and he wrote it in a book called the Bible. Now, some people think the Bible is a book of rules, telling you what you should and shouldn't do. The Bible certainly does have some rules in it. They show you how life works best. But the Bible isn't mainly about you and what you should be doing. It's about God and what he has done. Other people think the Bible is a book of heroes showing you people you should copy. The Bible does have some heroes in it, but as you'll soon find out, some of the people in the Bible aren't heroes at all. They make some big mistakes, sometimes on purpose. They get afraid and run away, and at times they are just downright mean. No, the Bible isn't a book of rules or a book of heroes. The Bible is most of all a story. It's an adventure story about a young hero who comes from a far country to bring, win back his lost treasure. It's a love story about a brave prince who leaves his palace, his throne, and everything to rescue the one he loves. It's like the most wonderful of fairy tales that has come true in real life. You see, the best thing about this story is, it's true. There are lots of stories in the Bible, but all the stories are telling one big story. The story of how God loves his children and comes to rescue them. It takes the whole Bible to tell this story. And at the center of the story, there is a baby. Every story in the Bible whispers his name. He is like the missing piece in a puzzle, the piece that makes all the other pieces fit together. And suddenly you see a beautiful picture. And this is no ordinary baby. This is the child upon whom everything would depend. This is the child who one day, but wait, our story starts where all good stories start, right at the very beginning. Friends, I would like to say a prayer for you as we read through the Jesus Storybook Bible together with friends from our church and our community. Father God, we thank you for the children that will be learning and growing as we read through the Jesus Storybook Bible and we learn about how your name is whispered throughout all creation throughout all eternity. We thank you for these beautiful, wonderful children. May you bless them and help them to grow in your love and in your word. In Jesus' holy name we pray. Amen. Thank you for reading this story with me today, friends. I hope you'll join us again soon. Bye for now.